hit my 1k subscribers i am super excited i cannot express how grateful i am to you guys and for those who haven't subscribed what are you waiting on do your girl a favor and do so so let's get into our new video Welcome back to my empire, sandwiches in my empire. Welcome. And for those that have been here before, cheers to you. So today we're going to talk about breakups. How to get over that guy. Period. The first thing I suggest that someone who is getting over a breakup would do, whether he or she, is to love yourself. You know? Go to the mall, the spa, get your hair done, your nails done. Just spend quality time with yourself. Love yourself. So start by appreciating yourself. Focus on yourself. Focus. Meditate. Exercise. Hit the gym. Work out. Get your body all in shape. Let him see what he is missing, but do it mostly for you. Do whatever that makes you happy. Whatever you were doing before that person was in your life, do that. Second thing is, do not text him. If you can't control yourself, sister, delete him, block him from calling, texting, everything i know most of you guys want to remain friends with your ex after the breakup it's perfectly fine but i think it's better if you give yourself some space the first period of the breakup so you can breathe give him space so he can breathe and then after you guys have recovered then you can continue being friends but at the beginning of the breakup i really don't think it's such a good idea being friends is not going to be the easiest because you guys still have feelings you still have emotion even if you don't act as if you do when you're with the person but inside you know you do and that's only going to cause you more pain and discomfort when you're going to try to detach so if you have anything at home that reminds you of him or a t-shirt that he used to wear that you now wear, you're going to throw that away. Or if you're not ready to make that big step, you can always put them in a box and put them somewhere that you're not going to see it. Because being reminded of someone going through a big breakup is kind of painful. We're not going to question ourselves, asking ourselves, what was wrong with me? Why they didn't choose me? Why they didn't stay? No, we're not going to feel sorry for ourselves. We're not going to stay in bed and cry two, four days, a month. No, it's unacceptable. We're going to self-sabotage ourselves by staying at home, staying in bed, eating ice cream, getting fat. Two days, yes. It's normal to feel emotional and to express yourself so cry if that makes you feel better but one month no this is time coming out of your life for what reason for a guy or a girl who didn't see your worth so no we're not gonna feel sorry for ourselves I'm gonna change the situation it's not gonna bring them back it's only gonna make you fat and ugly and you don't want that if this guy is seeing someone else do not go on her profile and stalk her because this is only gonna make you feel worse like don't do it you're gonna start comparing yourself to her and baby no we don't do that you are who you are and you are perfect in your own ways so is she even though most time they never are but you should not sit there cry and watch these instagram posts with them enjoying themselves while you're at home eating ice cream popcorn watching movie playing sad music and crying do not stalk his instagram either do not go on his page to see what he's doing especially if he's the one who broke up with you especially if he had moved on do not do that because this would make this is only going to cause you pain that you don't want or unless you do I don't know but I wouldn't want that so do not stalk him do not stalk her cut ties with his family member do not have that if you had a good if you had a good relationship with his family and you guys were close try to keep a distance it's okay to keep in contact by text message or call but you do not want to be in the same space you do not want to be all up in his family 
if you get what I mean. Give them them space and you take yours. And if your family keeps asking you about the person, be like, we broke up. Mind your business, none of your business. We ended it and that's final. Just shut it down. Tell them no, we're not gonna have this discussion. We are not together anymore and I wish not to talk about it. Same with your friends. So yeah, in this process of the breakup, you're gonna start reflecting, self-reflecting. You're gonna see what you want for your future, your future plans. You're not gonna rush into another relationship. I know most people are saying that, oh, they like to have a booty call. Not booty call, what do you call it? A rebound sex. That's the case, make sure that you make it very, very clear to the other person that you don't want a relationship, you're just coming out of one and you need time to heal. But personally, I think if you want to heal, you should take time on yourself and not start fucking around. So the next thing you don't want to do is to rush into another relationship. Give yourself, give yourself some time to breathe. Give yourself some time, space to heal. Nobody's gonna treat you the way you can treat yourself. So start by that. The same thing. Don't think that your happiness comes from someone else. It is from you. So don't stay there being sad and saying, oh, I can't live without this person. If that was your case, I'm sorry for you. Your breakup is gonna be damn hard. Make sure that the next relationship you are going into, after taking space, you want to do it and it's not just because you're lonely or you're sad or you just want to distract yourself from the pain that you're going through because it will end badly, just like the previous. I'm gonna think of that the world has ended because your relationship did, okay? We're gonna get up, we're gonna bounce back and we're gonna be happy because love is there for everyone we just have to be patient and let the universe work for us so thank you for watching my video i hope you guys like it and thank you again for the 1k subscribers Mwah! see you in my next video